future of AI in India is pretty bright because the the way I'm seeing the proliferation of artificial intelligence in uh, the common things that we do, um, it's it's going to soon be a mainstay and a cornerstone in what we do. I'm lucky to be invited by the Huawei to talk in this uh, symposium. My topic uh, is the artificial intelligence uh, education and uh, translational research of my school. In this talk, I will highlight a few uh, points. Number one, artificial intelligence is one of the ten pillars of computer science. Number two, the machine learning is part of uh, AI. So deep learning is in, uh, in the machine learning. That means, in short, is AI is not uh, deep learning. Uh, and uh, I will also introduce the other modules of our school to covering all aspects of the artificial intelligence. Uh, later, I will talk about the a multidisciplinary program, AI program, with the collaboration of the School of Computing and uh, our business school. This is called uh, Master of Science on Business Analytics and the uh, professors of the two schools will come to teach in this master program and the student will also do a, a capstone project for four months in the top uh, industry organizations. Uh, so from uh, this program, we try to add in value to the students such that they can work in the large finance organizations. Last and not least, I will talk about the translational research of the artificial intelligence in our school. The, it is about how to uh, transform, transfer the intellectual properties that currently are mostly in the publication into the real industry solution and the product. I will talk about a few collaboration models between the academics and the industry and uh, using some successful example of the translational research. In the end, I will talk about what we are expecting in this artificial intelligence ecosystem to collaborate with the India University and the companies with Huawei as a technical partners. Uh, the India has a very huge population, especially the young generation. But unfortunately, not all of them have the best uh, best uh, the education resource. But India has a lot of the in the remote area. But India has a lot of good teachers. Right? How we can spread the coverage of the education resource to cover the poor peoples? So uh, this is where AI can do. You know, we have uh, we there is fun. Uh, we have found that. There are a lot of the class uh, repeat grade by grade and uh, the most of the students are uh, asking the common questions. So we do believe the artificial intelligence assisted the education can help the normal students get the same kind of quality as well as the urban students. For more updates from CXO TV, please like and subscribe to our channel.